A local nonprofit partly funded a new statewide survey on the four-day class calendar. News Press Now's Marcus Clem joins us from the newsroom. The Herzog Foundation is teaming with the Show Me Institute for a critical look at a big change, dropping Monday from the class calendar, making it a day for staff recovery and preparation at the office. The Institute's work has three parts, but the top line finding, 64% of surveyed parents said they prefer the five-day class model. But this 64% to me says the majority of people still want the traditional model that affects more than just schooling. It affects parents and their home life and their jobs. Uh, in profound ways, and those districts need to keep those issues in mind. Board member Whitney Lanning, the leading local advocate for the four-day plan, says this research can't hold a candle to the district's own survey, in which about 62.3% of parents said they are in favor or are not opposed to the four-day plan. Lanning says bringing the four-day here, like over in Independence, Missouri, will fill some of the district's many, many open jobs. To me, there has to be a sense of urgency in saving this district. We can go four days and make jobs easier for staff and have uh, more qualified and certified staff to choose from, or we can stay doing what we're doing uh, and potentially face not being accredited. The foundation started out five years ago with $325 million of the late Stanley M. Herzog's money, which he left to support private Christian education. The foundation has used much of it, Lanning says, for causes unfriendly to public schools. Lanning says to also take the Herzog founded research with a grain of salt. Anytime that you see a statistic, you need to look in more to how that was collected. I would want to know who did they interview, who did they survey, how many people did they survey, you know, those types of things. Professor James Scholes, who is leading this research, tells me he does not oppose the four day idea as a concept. It could work in some districts, in some situations. Scholes says people need to be fully informed before they make a decision on the four day. Because it may not be the right model for them. I think that it could work. A good portion of the people in our survey do like this model, but I think about the individuals who it doesn't work for, we've got to have them in mind as well. We'll have the Show Me Institute survey data and the information from the St. Joseph School District attached to our story online now at newspressnow.com. Reporting from the newsroom, Marcus Clem, News Press Now.